my stick. Bring my stick. Good morning, everybody. Una good morning. Na teacher monja be this. Good morning. We want to try for introduce this class. This camera day, so it be turned around, so I cannot see myself. So I'm going to be using my iPad to see myself and to see your questions as well. So una good morning. Welcome to class. Class, don't start, everybody. Call your neighbor. Call your neighbor. Call your classmates. Let them join this class right now. All right. Let me see this. Okay, great. I'm live. Okay. Good morning, everybody. Welcome to class. <laughs> Today we are going to be looking at African Food and Nutrition 101. Good morning, everybody. If you can see me, if you can hear me very well, make sure you comment below. Let me know that you can hear me clearly. Let us dive into this chit chat today. Let me know who is online. Okay. So, I wanted us to talk a little bit about African food and nutrition because I keep hearing this all the time. Is African food healthy? Can I eat African food and lose weight? Am I sure that I can eat plantain amala and lose weight? You understand? So there's always these questions keep coming and I wanted us to really talk about it a little bit. I wanted us to, or I want us to, to think about some certain things a little bit think about them for yourself so that we can analyze it and see for ourselves that indeed african food is good so how many of you are the year pigeon they told me in the last class that they did the year grammar they did the year this english that i'm talking about let me know if you can hear me let me know if you can see me let me know if you understand pigeon because we want to talk this palaver so first of all tiwe we don't notice them for scientific studies the World Health Organization don't notice and say many more Africans are getting sick. You can go to Germany. Many more Africans are getting sicker and sicker. Many more Africans are getting fatter and fatter. The World Health Organization don't even talk, say, in the years to come, the rate at which Africans they go be sick, they go be fat, it go really skyrocket, it go increase. The prevalence of disease, that means, say, how often does this go be inside African community for among African them for Africa and African them for the diaspora go increase a great deal? Say they sick the way we always know them when we the year na year about them in those days. When we the year na year say cancer then are for Europe. Now plenty of people where they suffer from diabetes they then are for Europe they for America. Plenty of people where they suffer from obesity they then are for America. These days. It, it, studies they don't show say and prognosis they say in the years ahead to come african they will get more fatter and fatter african they will get sicker and sicker all this western disease the world on the year and before way with the year and from afar cancer hypertension high blood pressure stroke eh? type 2 diabetes it go now be very common for Africa. In fact, it don't even be very common for Africa now. In countries like South Africa, the rate of obesity is extremely high. Some documentary come up for even for Cameroon say the rate at which Cameroonian may be sick from cancer it is too high. In Nigeria, many states scientific study they show that people them they be fat they go. If any man they will need to hear this pigeon. Raise your hand in this class. Teacher Monjok is here to clarify. If you don't understand pigeon, let me know in the comments area. Because we want to talk about the reason then why African they, they get fatter and fatter. Why it be say wa papa them, wa grandma me them, wa great grandpapa them will not be the seed and fat the way we will be fat these days. Do you understand? Why it be say in the time of our great grandma me them? Will not be the years on kind of sick like cancer. Mommy don't die cancer. Mommy don't die high blood pressure. Papa don't die. I don't know stroke. Don't kill her. Why if we say in those days back then our ancestors don't be get all of that kind of diseases that today it is like saying a daily bread. One day, one month never pass. The one don't die breast cancer. The one don't die stroke. The brother don't die. Uh, hypertension, high blood pressure, don't kill them. Diabetes, 
don't kill her. Do you understand? And so I want to make for this class today, make we understand and make we think about them. Make we look the way we were grandparents, then great grandparents, their ancestors they used to live before, and the way we will really live today for try for see to see way this disease they come out. Waiting be the problem where it happen for we today. Because you know, at the end of the day, we have to ask ourselves some very serious questions. Yes, what is it that we are doing wrong? Where have we gone wrong? So, before I continue this class, I want to make all now now answer present. Anybody who is in class today, in Teacher Monjo's class today, answer present in the comment area below. Let me know where you're watching from. Let me know who you are. Do you understand? Make sure that you share this video because so many people, we African them, we're brother and sister them, community member them, they get for hear this news. Do you understand? Many of we will need to take this message very, very far because it gets to do with our health. And we know, say, health is wealth. Play with health no day. No, nothing you will do for this ground. If you are not healthy, you cannot walk. You can't take care of your children. You can't take care of your community. You can't fulfill purpose. So this is very important. Make sure that you are sharing this video, inviting your friends. Let us look at where this issue is coming from. From a scientific point of view, so many scientific papers that don't come out. When they show, we say African, they seek the goal, African, they fat the goal, African, then in the next couple of years, decades, this palaver go worse. So, I try for introduce and I talk now, say, make we look how we were great grandparents that they used to be live, live before. In fact, make we even look as we were mommy, then, papa, then, they be the live. Me, as I be the grow up, I grow up for some houseway. We will get farm for down house. How many of you now will get farm for down house? Comment below. Any man will no farm work. Any man will grow for house will get farm. Well, we will grow, uh, we will grow green, amaranth greens. Well, we will grow cassava. You will grow yam. You will grow corn. You will grow beans. Do you understand? Any man where he don't get grow for farm, we get grow for family house where farm they make it raise his hand because. Now, so what about they be the grow that time? They be get farm for back compound way. Or most of the chop will be the chopper. The common now from farm, straight from farm, very fresh. You go go for farm, go harvest bitter leaf. So the same farm, you go harvest maize, corn, where you go can't dry and take make fufu day. For the same farm, you go harvest cassava, where you go take and make cassava fufu, water fufu, you go take and turn her into gari or eba. For the same farm, you go harvest your pepper. The same farm, you go collect tomatoes, onions. Because that's how we will grow. So you will realize and say, in those days, for our papa, their time, they be the, collect their chop from directly from farm, straight on top table. That means that they will harvest bitter leaf, collect and wash them straight, where you no know, pass through any chain. But today, if you want to compare them today, how many of we would go buy what you fresh? Especially those of we African, the way they take diaspora away. Forget African chop, it be so difficult for this side. And so we don't be left only with the alternative for buy conserves. We don't be left only with the alternative for buy chop where they don't freeze them. We don't be left for buy na chop where they don't contain them. Team chop, canned foods. You know, we, we, if you look back for that time, our parents then, they will get time for go farm. They go walk their farm. They go work out, go farm. You know, do all that kind of thing. Can't cook. Today, we there for busy lifestyle, busy body. They do we we. We don't feel even cook. We don't get time again. Some of we even now say we don't even use our time correctly. We know that we never portion our time better. And so, by the time you don't finish, finish work, you don't run, go kindergarten, collect, speaking there. Come back, you don't get time for cook. So, what is the alternative? You buy pizza. Another alternative, you don't go for uh, 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 all of these uh, uh, fast food areas. You collect fried potatoes, french fries. You don't collect a, a chicken where they don't fry them. I don't want to call any brand the name because I don't want to sabotage their brand. You understand? We the chop fast food, convenience food and fast food. As compared to that time where we well, provided the chop directly straight, fresh chop. We get all in nutrient there for inside. You know, all the nutrient them, correct, come out directly for farm, 
there is chopper. But we, these days, we go carry chopper, we don't pack trans fat. We don't fry your inside oil three times. Pack butter on top. Do you understand? With the chopper. You understand? Back in the days, if you want to compare them with your papa, they are chopped them, be be less processed. Do you understand? It will be very minimally processed. Even people they want to be going to village market for go buy chop. Now that, that chop will be there for market, that chop will come out straight for farm. Not be so a lie. No, if I'm telling a lie, people should comment below here. You know, minimally processed food. Even if it will be a chicken or it will be a goat or it will be cow, you will see and say, we, for example, me, I grow for household, we get poultry. We will be red. Only at them plenty like one thousand. We be get gold them for household the rare and we say say we we sabi exactly the kind of chop with this gold and this chicken that they chop. Not be today way. Most of we the go na market we go see live chicken where person don't sweat for grow them for like forty five days. We go prefer to go buy na that frozen chicken way. We don't see and say in one time it fat so in one time it, it large. When you don't know how they don't pump that that chicken before it, it fat so. When you buy chicken then these days way, it don't take now 12 days, it don't turn mature chicken. And on top of that, we don't know how we did you feed this chicken. If you did read scientific, scientific knowledge, nutrition knowledge, you go see and say most of the chicken then they so then you pump them with antibiotics, with a hormone. And when you get that hormone, you chop and continuously, consistently for your skin, it will do you bad. Because it can't disrupt your own normal hormonal system. It is introduced in there for your body when you're not supposed to be there. That is the problem. Now, one of the problems will be that. So, what grandpapa them, what grandma me them, my mommy them, they go raise their own chicken where they didn't give them the correct better chop from not only the same mace where they don't gather them, they don't dry them, they don't grind them, they add a number of other few things there for the gear for chicken in the chop. Now, the thing that we go see and say for Africa there, Chicken way it grow for it's a compound. You know, a fat bill like the one way you see them for this for this side. Do you understand what I'm saying? So you will also understand in those days when we be small picking, oh don't go school so come back. Before, first of all, would you even work for food for go school? And remember, say for go school, you need work like 40 minutes, go work 40 minutes, come back. In other words, when you do physical activity, we will not sabi safe. Before you won't even work at that 45 minutes, go school, you don't feel work at distance for go carry water. Especially as you know, as our country, they, they don't cut water for three days. You go work up, you go go carry water onto your head for shasha point time. Before you want to even finish that one, you don't feel clean house, you don't wash pan them, you don't dry clean floor. If you don't look at some of them, you don't feel cook before you carry yourself so you go to school. In other words, you don't do activity, you don't burn calories then for that for that day so day before your day one even start. Do you understand? And then when you don't go to school, come back. For we particularly, my mommy will be ever greasy more we'll buy chop for street, street for street for street side. My mommy will make sure say they give we one lunch box in those days. Because it will be like and say make we buy street food because you don't know as well they the cooker. You don't know till they don't use and cooker. Yes, by the time you don't go that one come back, you never even she don't remember they will tell you say when I come on, go outside, when I, when I go play, when I go play dodgy, when I go play hopscotch. So at the end of the day, we'll be really active all the time by the time you don't finish place with a finish now go back tree that for corner you don't go climb on top you have to go up and chop orange tree to be there so i saw tree be there we will go have a sour all right we'll bring and we'll make juice drink no no add sugar day do you understand but today most of us will don't get even now this ability or this possibility will be for this other side for europe for america for uk People then they want to buy juice every day. Can juice, orange juice, uh, fizzy drinks, man, no call their name. All of them. People then they want to, they be pass one day where they never drink one of these fizzy drinks there. Every single day. How many of you members say that time will be the grow up? Before you want to drink Fanta, it will be not saying your birthday. If you know saying that true, comment below. Because me as I say, when it will be not birthday, we will drink Fanta, drink Coca Cola. It will be even better when you go even chop some special meal. Yes, special meal time will be special dishes will be for special occasions. There, when I say now, when your house they will actually the come on in those days, that's what it will be for our house as that's what I grow. Now, when your house day, when you go see, they will cook, chop, put some more oil, meat, plenty, some more, they will add 
plenty meat because say na occasion special occasion married traditional married day born house you understand or even cry die now that time special occasion is chop on a kind of really calorie intense calorie dense chop them all this other chop them generally for our house will not be the chopped chicken all the time because first of all plenty of our grandpapa they were grand them they don't even get the purchasing power if now if not say they grow the chicken for their house they say, or they grow the goat for their house they don't get purchasing power for going to buy meat all the time but today we don't can dice for our guests more money eh we go join carry one full chicken put her inside on our soup we go join carry two kilo meat Plus assorted meat and shaki and kanda and towe. Join now. Oh, that means by the time you don't finish cook eru. Eh? Or at least three kilo assorted meat in the inside pan. Yes! You understand? I remember some time when <laughs> some friend of my husband, he be just can't come at that time. So we don't invite and say, make it can house, make it can chop. We don't make chicken, make everything. You know, serve for table. We say, bros, chop this your own. Take your pan, chop your own. Yes, Christmas, that's right. Bros, look, chicken, eh, 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 thai so. He say, hey, it's tough for friends, say. Mama, say, pour moi. That means it's tough for friends, say, na ma own. That means me, I get for chop the chicken thai. Yes, because in those days, when you grow, you do want to see chicken thai, when they give you chicken thai, if na, na papa, they chop chicken thai. Na papa, they chop all that better, juicy part there for chicken. Picking them, you know, on a siam, on a siam, one, one time, if you don't even get gulok, you don't get chicken, you for divine and you and your brother them. Yes! Yes! <laughs> you understand? But now we don't come this, we get small purchasing power. Every single day, meat. If not be meat, na chicken. Or na goat meat, pepper soup. Oh. Today, goat meat, pepper soup. Tomorrow, a for roll with assorted meat. To another day, a roll with assorted meat. In fact, we don't the overdo them. So the thing we be then I say the fact of the matter I say most of we we the want to chop the same kind of chop them or we the want to chop African chop but we don't still live that same lifestyle because how many of we all most of we will not get moto? How many of you are the worker for food go school? Now boss, even if you even work for go even take boss play way lift then go take lift you never still even take steps again. So physical activity again, it don't reduce for this one generation. We don't turn na couch potato. We do not only for couch. We do nothing. We watch television, Netflix. On top of that couch potato, we still chop popcorn. On top the drink coca. Do you understand? Plus, we don't need exercise again. And then we not get purchasing power. We will chop fast food. All kinds of fast food them way. All kinds of junk food them. All kinds of convenience food. All kinds of thin food the way they get artificial. Preservatives, the inside, number one, they don't be fresh, they don't even get nutrients them again. We they chop all kind of chicken, they will all pump and genetically modified organisms they call them GMO. Do you understand? We they chop canned food, they will get additives, they will be directly linked for cancer. Now, one of the reasons then that way we African, then for Africa, and even for diaspora, we they seek the goal, we they fight the goal, we they wonder, say, what did it happen? Do you understand? So, with that said, Literature and scientific research don't show say a shift day, a transition day. That means we don't the transition from one normal traditional African chop the way we used to chop our grandparents they used to chop them. We don't transition, we don't shift small because of one reason or the other. We don't leave, we don't neglect for the chop the fruits and the vegetable vegetable them, the grains and the legumes them. Do you understand? The complex carbohydrate, the way we used to chop our staples them, and the way we used to chop and used to combine them very well in those days, and not say any time we get complex carbohydrate, we get vegetable for corner. Today, I don't post them for, 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 for group here. I ask and say, I post some plate for a plantain and mala. I say, now which thing you go add them for this plate? Make it make this plate be nourishing. We go nourish your body, go give you better thing them for your body, make you strong, make you grow, make you no sick. And they still wait for an answer. If you never answer them, answer them. And before I continue, I want to invite you to make you go right down for YouTube. Run, go YouTube for Shape of Africa TV. Subscribe for day. Because teacher Mon Jock will get plenty of we'll get for talk about them. We'll be very, very serious palaver for our health. We'll get plenty of we'll talk about them for promote our health, for prevent disease. 
and for live a healthy lifestyle, for be happy, you understand, and for be healthy. So, for continuing this talk, I want to make we reason together, you know, because some people in the ever talk say, ah, I don't fat so nasi kind of African chop don't make them because I chop African chop. Now I ask and say, what well, grandpapa, our grandpapa, them, our great grandpapa, they be they, they, they chop the same chop. You know, we see them fat, fat, fat like we. Why? Because their activity, their, their physical activity life will be very high. They will be really extra active. They will go farm. They will work on food for go carry water. Work on food for go school. All of that. Most of them will work on food, and then they will chop fresh chop, unprocessed chop, unrefined chop. Do you understand? You understand what I mean? You know, and other things them we come. And so we today we get for look how we we the we the chop. We get for look how we the live our lifestyle. We get for take stock of things the way we the chop, things the way we the we the do. We, some person say, ah, uh, if I want lost weight, I get for only drink now. Uh, I get for only make na, na celery juice a drink. Chop one carrot and one leaf lettuce. Now they can't lie then that way, or you both man don't come fool now with all this their fat fake diet them where they pro, pro, they propagate around internet here. Yeah. Do you understand? Very big lie. No mean for talk say some the diet they need to work. Of course, if you reduce your calorie intake, you will you will likely lose weight. But I want to make the case today say African food now one of the healthiest food them on the planet. In fact, for 2015, so Study will be carried out when the Lancet publisher, any man will know the Lancet, no saying a very highly commendable, trustworthy, accredited uh, 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 journal be that. They need to pro, pro, uh, publish any kind of nonsense. So, for 2015, the Lancet will publish this study where it will be carried out for 187 countries then, for Africa. Do you understand? They be one, look how this African country they did chop, what thing they did chop. You know, they want, they want to analyze the, the consumption of food, they like fruits, like vegetables, like legumes, you know, like 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 um, like carbohydrates. For make an, a, a comparison, say, how this people they chop in comparison to how European people and American people they, they chop. How these people they are chop day, way to make up their diet in comparison to how they, the diet of American people. Because remember, say, many studies also say American people they too fat. And the same story don't show and say they did over fat now because of the thing the way they did chopper. So this study will be carried out for 2015. They do it for 187 countries, including Chad, including uh, Senegal, including Mali. Wait till they can find out now, say, African food them, or that country them way, like Chad, Mali, Senegal, they get the most healthiest diet them. And they rank even for a higher ranking than European countries them or America in terms of nutrition, in terms of their diet, how they are the composition of their chop. They realize and say these people then they so they they are, they are the composition of their chop be so healthy. They realize and say people they for chat for Mali for Senegal. They they chop a lot of vegetables, fruits them. They they chop a lot of lean meats. Do you understand? They they chop a lot of legumes. They they chop a lot of carbohydrates, complex carbohydrates. And the thing where you make up their chop, they even realize and say, and these people then for this category, where they chop this good, healthy food, then they be extra healthy. Now when they make conclusion, they say, African foods now one of the most healthiest foods them on the planet. Because, and the case we want to talk about today, why African food is good for you? For what For which reason why African food? See, I me man no food, you say make you go chop ham, a uh, uh, turkey. Uh, sorry, me you go chop now nah, cheese for yeah. Me will chop now, nah, I don't know, rich man jimanji. I like for color, so I like for color rich man jimanji, butter tortoise, because that they are chopped, they don't get name. Do you understand? I want make you understand say we are all chop them. Now the healthiest, one of the healthiest, because we get chopped the way it enter every single five, every single one of the five food categories there. For fruits, for vegetables, for complex carbohydrates, legumes. Do you understand? For healthy lean proteins for heart healthy fat all of that we get them baba god don't bless we too much with rich source of, of 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 food of all kinds of shape and color and taste we get them all 
In fact, we chop them, some of we chop them like sorghum, like millet, if you compare in terms of nutrition, we chop them like quinoa. Today, we African, the one, the one, the talk, oh, quinoa, quinoa, quinoa. See, and before quinoa, we won't be. Sorghum, be don't be. Before quinoa, be won't be. Millet, if be don't be. You understand? We the one make so much smoothie today, one make juice for say one loose way. We will go take, I don't know, one of these, they funny thing they will don't package up for day. But we get proud of them or chop them like baoba, where they be extremely nutritive. Do you understand? We get baoba for day. Yes, we get baoba, we get moringa. How many of you know moringa? How many of you know baoba? Who na sabi the nutritional content of baoba? When you want to make that fruit juice, that smoothie for morning time, when you want to take drink. If you get moringa, you get baobab, you day well, you day fine, your body day fine. Yes! You know, when you want to go buy some funny, funny tea there for acid day, we get fever grass for compound. Eh? We get fever grass for compound. You know what fever grass will do for your skin? Yes! So, I want to make you understand, say, African food is not one of the healthiest foods on the planet. The problem with African food and why plenty of people, even myself, would come out fat with African chop. Now, because say, we don't change the way we cook them. In those days, for mommy, they be the, they be the, they be the ferment chop a lot. They be the ferment a lot of things. Even Gary will drink them. Now, fermented chop be that. Water fufu na fermented chop be that. And we know say fermented chop, it be extremely good for the gut flora. Because you know, say for inside your gut flora, you get this bacteria, this good bacteria, the way you live for inside your gut flora, where your body actually need them, make you get a healthy gut flora. So all this fermented chop, the way they used to go, in those days, fridge no be there. They be supposed to ferment chop, so that meat chop last. They be supposed to dry chop, meat chop last. So fermented food be good for you. Do you understand? You know, they be used to grill a lot. But today, any small thing one be, we don't defry. That means that today we we'll defry all dust. If they never defry, never plunge chop inside oil. You didn't say never cook them. Today, so you people they go argue with me, tell me, say if you know roast chicken or you know, or, or if you fry chicken, if you know fry chicken for inside oil, you know it's sweet inside stew, you know it's sweet inside uh, 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 pepper, bell pepper, sweet bell pepper sauce. That lie. What about them? They be the roast them. They be the roast chicken. Do you understand? And today we feel the same. But I said we fry all things, fry chin chin, fry pop off, fry uh, 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 donut, fry fish, fry chicken, fry meat. Eh? You want even cook jello fries? You must fry meat. Why you get for fry all things? The problem is how we the cook. In those days, they go pounding, pounding, pounding. They go pound millet. And I talk to you go walk pound millet today again. No, because many of you the walk will not get time for pound. You understand? But the, the method of cooking and the method of preparation of what chop them, it be also a very big contributing factor for the way we, the people that we live long as compared to today. No, today we don't get time. Do you understand? So African food be very good for you because we get plenty superfood. Them the way white man they will call them superfood today. We get them plenty. We get sogum, we get millet, we get baobab. Do you understand? We, we, we get moringa, we get fever grass, we get bitter leaf. People, the way they get diabetes, bitter leaf is good for you. Yes! We get plenty chopped there for pregnant women there. We get chopped the way hypertensive people, they will chop, they will yell fine for their body. We get chopped the way even now we get liver problem, we get kidney problem. You chop and it will yell fine for your skin. Do you understand? So, I want to make we continue now for look at some nutritional concept there. Because if I say when we talk about this nutrition, say so you get to understand thing we talk about. If I say make you know thing when I chop, this chop will you chop every day. What is food? What it be when I talk say nutrient? What it be nutrient? What it be calorie? Every day they will tell you say no. Uh, some people they will ask you how many calories I need for chop. They don't even submit you when a calorie. How many nutrient? Which kind of nutrient are supposed to chop if I get high blood pressure? What it be? What it be nutrient we get for sabi? Waiting be chop, you get for sabi. I be begin talking the other time. I say, chop now. Anything when you de eat them, you de drink them, you de ingest them, you de digest them, your body de absorb them, where it give your body the possibility for stay alive and for grow and for repair. So anything where you de chop them, where you de drink them, when I begin take note, teacher Monjok will ask questions at the end of the year. Yes, there's examination coming. 
So anything where you chop them, you the drink them, where your body will digest them, it will absorb them, it will permit your body make it grow, make it repair, make it stay alive. Now chop that. And from this chop where you chop them, chop it get substances. When now that substance, in fact, where they like information where it tell the body say this person don't chop protein, he don't chop carbohydrate, he don't chop fat. He don't chop vitamin A, B, B1, B6, B12. He don't chop this and that. So nutrients then, now substance then where they come off for, chop where you chop them, for the nourishment of your body, for keep your body, make it fine. Do you understand what I'm saying? So anytime where you chop, make sure say, you won't be informed about the kind of chop where you chop. If that chop where you chop them, go give you nutrients when a substance where you help nourish, grow, uh, and repair your body or not because if you know which chop carry which kind of nutrient you go be better position for make better choices as i don't talk the problem with being i say if you want to compare the way where your grandpapa them were ancestors they used to chop and, and the way we will really chop today while grandpapa they be the chop nutrient rich or nutrient dense what did that one mean mean i say they be the chop chop the way it get high quality nutrients the nutrients will not be lost along the way in the course of processing the food. You know, they will be chopped highly unprocessed or very minimally processed food. Then, where because it be minimally processed, it contain all or most of the nutrients. Then, but today we will chop most of the chop. They will chop now fast food, convenience food. You understand? When they don't process some, some of them like flour, what they use and they make pop off. They don't move. Rip the flour of the nutrients, move the outer covering of that corn where you get the most nutrients, the fiber. They don't move and throw it because they want to make a make pop off taste fine. The thing where being I say, when you call that one, I say now empty calories because say they don't move the nutrient where they for the food. Then you take now the chaff, it they say you, you, you they don't give they don't shift that uh, 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 fufu, hmm? they don't shift that fufu corn. Then they move, they take all the nutrients, they throw it, they give you na chaff when you want to go today. You understand, and then they do and so for a number of reasons because they want to say make you make make you make you get some particular taste or feel for your for your skin. So we therefore understand. Remember, say every time we the chop, no not only about the taste of the chop. It must the chop where the chop must to be chop where it can for can nourish your body because if the chop need nourish your body, ah, we go get the repercussion. So the repercussion go come come earlier than we even expect. So we don't talk about food. We don't talk say food. Now, anything when you chop them, when you drink them, when body you digest them, absorb them, assimilate them, you understand? For permit your body for grow, for build, for repair, you understand? For stay alive. And then, from the chop where you chop them, every single chop where you chop them contain a particular nutrient. Now, why that we allow for talk say, any diet where you restrict you of a particular food, you fit probably lose weight, yes, but... At the end of the day, and with time, because we are looking at things over time, you will see that so you also restrict your body of a certain number of nutrients. Now, why that way, if you did do some very bad diet, especially as a woman, tomorrow you will go come, you don't feel bone picking. Because the nutrient, the way we're supposed to sustain the production of your ovaries and ovules and your eggs, you're not denied for chopping. You say you want to do so so and so diet. You want to restrict your consumption of this and this and this. You want to chop now one leaf lettuce and one carrot, drink water every day. You understand? So we get for understand that anything we chop, it gets effect for our body. Because the chop where the chop now information. When you see one sweet potato, yes, the potato is sweet to your mouth because you get taste, taste buds for your mouth where they give the re it get receptor them, you receive the sweetness. Mm -hmm. Now true. It is sweet, it keep you go fine. But when she don't chop that chop, you don't mash and mash and stay, enter inside your small intestine, large intestine for digestion. What will happen is say metabolism go start. That means say your body go secrete enzyme them when they go can't work on top of that sweet potato. They start to dissect and deconstruct that sweet potato for extract the nutrients, the nutritive substance with that sweet potato get them for your, for your skin. Do you understand? And so the amount of nutrients where your body go fit extract and go depend on how fresh that pot sweet potato day so they will be different person where you chop raw sweet potato the body will receive different thing than person where you chop sweet potato where they don't cook them for long 
or sweet potato where they don't boil them or they don't they don't they don't um, they don't roast them for inside oven. Do you understand? So your body will work on top of that sweet potato, extract the nutrients. They say ah, sweet potato. This way you get an, a quite a, a a good number of complex carbohydrate then. Mm -hmm. Then enzyme uh, 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 they will work on up on on them. Impulse they will be sent for your brain way. Brain will understand say ah, complex carbohydrate don't come. Energy, energy, energy. What do you get for do? We get for metabolize this 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 carbohydrate then from this sweet potato. We change them. Insulin. A, a body go say head go say produce insulin because a, 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 carbohydrate don't be transformed into glucose. Sugar don't enter blood body. We need to get this sugar out of body for enter into the cell. Then you understand. So all of this complex mechanism they take place now. Why do I just say chop now? Information for the body. So you when you know this, you will know how to choose what you choose, how you do cook them, and all, all of that. And nutrients now the substances that way that chop the provide. The next thing now calories. What it be calories? Would you ever hear calorie here? Calorie chop 1200, chop 2000 calories, chop this. What is a calorie? Calorie now the measure of energy. First of all. Me understand say your body need energy for function, just like motor need petrol for function. If motor no get petrol, you no get petrol or other stuff that maybe like oil, some particular function you no go take place. No go take the petrol because motor without petrol, you know if you work out, you know you know go move a muscle. So your body the same way it need calories. When calories now the unit of energy from the food where you the chop them. It means that any chop where you chop and get a, a certain amount of energy when the body go need them or take them, use them. You understand what I'm saying? So, uh, for example, you go get like, I say plantain, 100 grams of plantain. They go tell you, say, 100 grams of plantain get 117 calories. It, may, it be like the same way you go say, this moto de so, this moto need 50 liters of petrol to be able to start or this motor need at least one liter of petrol to be able to kick start the engine do you understand so there is same thing every human being from baby to adult get a certain number of calories the way your body need them at rest with that one minute say well you know you do nothing that means say your body need a certain amount of calories for just breathe you know just say you did breathe matter for example say you just sleep your body need energy for just the keep your, 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 your core organs them functioning now calories that way your body need at rest do you understand and then the column for nutritional science say basal metabolic rate so you need a certain number of calories just for just for breathe now why that way when you do some kind of diet way if you have over restrict your caloric intake at one time, you go first start small, small way. You feel say you be over weak, you know. You feel say you get headache. You understand? Some people then, if they go some extreme level, they start cash call. Why? Now because say your body need to get enough energy for function. Organ they need to function properly. Your your heart need energy for beat. Your heart need energy for pump blood from your heart to the different parts of your body and bring them back. Do you understand? And so when you restrict your caloric intake for, 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 for under some certain level for a long period of time, you will do yourself more harm than good. Do you understand? So, calories, we person need them, each of we need them, be different. And uh, uh, teacher mom job, where I be, and need a different number of calories than my see. Sister and Red way the watch, or Sister Joanna way the watch, or Sister Mayo Obed. We need different, different. Why? Because we be different. We 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 our age we be different. Our height be different. Do you understand? We 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 do different activity. Them some people them maybe me at the at the at do activity maybe once in a week. But Sister Joanna need plenty more energy because it run. Or Sister and Red need plenty more energy because it will run every day maybe ten kilometers. Do you understand? So your caloric intake, your caloric need go differ by age, by uh, uh, activity level, you understand, you know, and all of that. So it be different. And now why that way? When you go for some, do some diet program, they carry one diet program, one calorie intake for all man. You know, say problem. They, that person where they give that kind of diet program, program no sabiti way they do. You know, sabiti way they talk. Do you understand what I'm saying? You get forget a diet program where it be cut to your needs because we need different caloric intake for our different ages and activity levels.
You don't understand what I mean? Any questions so far for inside the class today? Yes. And so, uh, small picking will need a different amount of calories than big man. In other words, small picking will need a different number of energy, put and so. Or a diesel motor will need a different number of liter of petrol for worker than a limousine, stretch limousine will need. You understand? And so, if you give your body the right amount of calories where it need, it will actually help you if you give one loss weight for loss weight more. Plenty people that feel saying that by completely restricting your calories where you want loss weight, go loss weight. No, your body get way with the function. If you don't do human biology, you will know how body the function, body the adapt to the routine the way you give her. The more you restrict calories, the more the body the thing say, hey, I there for some days I for yell. It then they say calories and then it can't come out. So the small one way I get I make I keep her for my skin. Because if I born and now this person don't give me calorie tomorrow, I risk for die. Oh. So I go keep them. Now, why that way? Some people they receive calorie, they reach to some place and they still lost weight. Because their body don't start to, to uh, adapt for that calorie restricted mode. Do you understand? And so you now go ask me, say, okay, how many calories may, way, I need them for lost weight? Before you want to find out how many calories where you need them for lost weight, you get to first of all know how many calories where you need them for first of all stay alive. Yes. It's normal. Before you want to know how many uh, uh, calories we motor need and for run from Douala calories. How many liters of petrol we some yas bus bus need and for run from Douala Yaoundé. You first of all know how many liters of petrol we that yas bus need and for first me in the first start. Now the same thing be that. Do you understand? And normally we can't end this class today. We will end up with this calorie recommended uh, the daily intake, they call them RID for nutrition, recommended daily intake of carbo calories for life, for growth, for repair and all of that. So how much energy will your body need them for just be alive? Normally, plenty BBB nutrition, nutrition institution them, like FDA, WHO, don't come to a set value or a set number for person way be healthy, more we talk about woman them first. For woman the way they be healthy, when they get an ideal weight, you know, and everybody ideal weight be different depending on your age and your height. Do you understand? Now why they talk about BMI in a different class be that. So um, normal adult woman way be healthy they for ideal weight. For example, make we say some woman way eat day one point six three meters. You understand in height, if they must say 28 years old. By the way, we have a, a this thing. Let us go ahead and write that on the board. Where's my pen? So, uh, woman, when you get the age of 28 years, you get height. For 163 centimeters. Calories, where you get for chop? Now, how much? Now, you want to ask her, now, you be that. So, that recommendation, what will be the term about where WHO, World Health Organization, or other organizations like the FDA, they don't put them. They say for this kind of person, where you get ID weight, you don't get no problem for your health. Do you understand? You don't get no problem with your health. This kind of person, if it definitely they chop like 2,000 to 2,200 calories a day if it be burn that amount. Do you understand what I'm saying? So, we talk about 2,000, my pen don't stop for right, 2,000 calories per day. So, before you want to calculate how many calories you need them for loss, when you first go know how many calories where your body need them, in the state of rest, that means your BMR, basal metabolic rate. And then you calculate also, you know, how many calories your body need them in the state of activity. So you get the TDEE, -E, we'll talk about that, and the TEA, we'll talk about that in another session. Now I don't tell you, I say, any man go for YouTube, Shape of African TV, go subscribe for the O, because teacher mom job in class, now for them go to be every, every Tuesday, every other Tuesday. So, they recommend the RDI, recommended daily intake for calories for a healthy person with an ideal weight. As we don't mention, I'm now about 2,000 calories. Maybe we just call it 2,000 calories. And for that 2,000 calories, don't talk, say, that healthy person feed the chop between 45 to 
of that calories get for come off for carbohydrate. We will talk about all that different nutrient then in this future class, just for giving an idea about the way I talk about. So, from that 2,000 calories we go for chop for every day, 45 to 65% go for come off from carbohydrate. Do you understand? Another 20 to 35 percent will come out from fats, and then the proteins they calculate them a different way depending on the number of kilos of that person. Do you understand? So, when you know this value from this value, if you're a person where you want to lose weight, don't increase weight, you will be able to calculate first of all your basal metabolic rate that means say your the amount of energy or calories where you need them. At rest, when your body needs to do nothing. From there, you will be able to calculate the amount of energy where your body needs them for when you do physical activity. You get formula the way that you use them. We will break them down. We will not enter into any mathematical uh, 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 complications for here. So, for recapitulate, today, too, we don't talk for inside this class today. We don't make the case why uh, African, them, according to scientific studies, them, according to research, and we don't even see them. Uh, why we African them for Africa or African them for the diaspora would they get only fatter and fatter would they get sicker and sicker and why the WHO and other institutions the health institution, institution they don't talk say in the years to come we African they will go even be sicker and sicker we will carry collect all these westernized diseases the way our great grandparents they don't even know them. We don't talk about the reason or we don't look at the, the differences between the way we were grandpapa them they used to chop, the way they used to live their life in those days, you know, and the way we, we would live our life today. We don't see and say that it gets some shift where it take place. It gets some transition where it take place in the nutritional area. We didn't move, we don't move from the traditional way of eating of our ancestor them. When we be made up of freshly cooked food, them fresh from the farm to the to the table, or fresh from the village market to the table, we don't move from the traditional food or way of eating or dietary habits of eating lots of vegetables with our staple carbohydrate. Then we don't move from the way we we do physical activity, from the lifestyle of working on food for going for go church, for go school, for go carry water, for go farm and all of that. We don't need stop for chop fresh chicken meat where they grow arm for our front. We don't move now. We don't need chop more of fast food then. Where you get plenty trans fats and all of that. We don't need chop convenience chop. Tin tomato, now you buy. Tin this one, now will buy. Tin everything, everything now tin. And we don't talk about it yet. And I will make separate video for show you now. How the kind of story they don't find out. I'll say all this tin tin them, geisha, all of that will be chop. It get chemical, they be used some chemical for seal that thing will be directly linked with cancer. And so the reason, plenty reason why people they we African they don't call for every day we hear cancer. They want don't get cancer. They want don't get cancer. They want that say cancer come on. You understand? Now they, now they now they shift. You know, these days we will prefer for buy chicken where they don't put injection inside it tie press and meat fat than for buy normal chicken where they don't grow forty five days and more. Do you understand? We, did, we don't get now some purchasing power where it permits we for chop the thing away. In those days, we used to chop an apple Christmas time. We used to drink an apple Christmas time or for special occasion there. These days, now a days, you receive what every day don't go to the supermarket, don't buy drink, fizzy drink. We don't buy Fanta, buy Coca. It doesn't say water with the drink. And no person where can't this place for you. It drink, fizzy drink for two years, you never buy bottle water. Do you understand? And I know one point finger not only for them. And the point finger even for my own self. Because at one point, I saw Mrs. I'll be, be try, I'll be do. Do you understand? Just because they will get some more money for buy chicken, go buy one fat chicken, eh? And you know say this a be cool. When I don't put spices, I put your fire on top, roast them. Oh, now don't cut it and show for that chop, chop them. Do you understand? Meanwhile, if you want to look up in those days, ah, before you want chop rice and, and chicken, it will be at Christmas time. It may be at some birthday party. You know, chop the way we require a lot of oil, you know, a lot of meat, a lot of assorted meat. It may be at that way, born house don't they? If not, we born house, na wedding, or na cry die. Na so no. So, all of the, the ways that we used to chop that time, we don't see chop them. We don't see do them again so. We don't see walk out. 
Today, we the show for couch, we the watch television from morning time to night. In those days, how many of you get television? In fact, that when me I be the grow television, be the start now for whatever at ten o'clock or morning time. By four o'clock, you don't finish. I'm not even supposed to age me too. And you see, teacher mom jump down. Oh, yes. Television be not finish for four o'clock. So by the time you can't school four o'clock, don't really reach. You don't even get time for watch television. And even if television be big, we be grow for inside house where television be the better inside some cupboard way. They close and poop a lock. <laughs> They will want surprise you, they won't punish you. You don't die, you don't poop a lot for adult television. You don't even watch TV. So, which other thing will be get? Now, hopscotch, now, dodging ball. You understand? By the time you don't finish play dodging, so then you sweat. What you happen? You go go cut tower sock for tower sock tree. You climb mango tree, you climb guava tree, you chop fresh snacks. Do you understand? Today, we're fresh snack them. Now, gummy bear, now, biscuit, chocolate, and all of that. So we don't make the case and we we'll see the reason why we we'll grow fatter and fatter, we we'll grow sicker and sicker because we don't transition from our traditional healthy heritage way of life and dietary habits and behaviors to a more westernized way of eating where it not the really give our body the nutrients the way we need. We let it even work out again. We don't turn a couch potato. We won't go any side in a moto on a bus. Even play when you feel you walk up for food, you see stairs, you go take stairs, you know the one client stairs again. We don't be lazy. You know, so on study come on, they say sitting is killing you. Most of us will do job the way they make and you sit you don't for five to nine. You go she don't she don't she don't she don't she see a lot of sitting so be linked directly with other diseases, obesity. Do you understand? And obesity be linked with metabolic syndrome when another old chapter now be that. So um we don't talk about, we don't talk about three terms, the nutritional terms, the way we don't try to deconstruct them. Because if you want to go, if you want to understand how a body function, how you're supposed to nourish yourself, it'd be important for understand this term then, where this your dietitian them or nutritionist or your doctor, they ever use a way you say they understand jack. Do you understand? When they start talking about nutrient, calories, you know, serving size, portion size and all of that. You know, they understand. I will say, make we deconstruct this term there for some very simple way where all will fit you on, we digest and we swallow them. Do you understand? So, I hope so you don't enjoy this class plenty, students. <laughs> I see all on our own day class today. For the next classes, will be live on YouTube, Shape of African TV, every other Tuesday. Me say every other two weeks, Tuesday. I want to make we join we for day. When I come and support and TZ, me, I'm not afraid to ask you. Support and TZ. Yes. Because this thing, we need to take this message very far. Una, those of you who don't attend class today, we are going to make them a top priority for take this message. Share them with you in our community. Share them with you in our household members. Yes. Ask yourself a few questions. This chop where is chop and so which nutrient they will enter my body where go help my body make it grow, make it repair, make it heal wounds there. Where go make and make me live longer, stronger, healthier. Do you understand? Take this message, share them with everybody for your community. Take and go church. Make sure say you hit that share button. Maybe people then hear this news. Do you understand? Co invite them for this page where they can't know her. If you already follow me for Instagram, Shape of African, Nama, Instagram name. For Twitter, Shape of African as well. And for YouTube, Shape of African TV. My blog will come up soon, shapeofafrican.com. Where, of course, if you don't always exist, but we will update them for bring you all this nutritional information because health is wealth. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much. <laughs> My can't worry. Remember, say at the end of uh, the year, we will get the examination where everybody gets for pass this examination. Now, teacher, mom, job be this. Thank you for class. Coming to this class. Class, it don't close.